welcome back everyone to Songs of Six. You know, we have a uh, very peaceful settlement around here. We need to change that though. I'm trying to find out a good layout for a, uh, a wall which we can use to fire upon people. I'm thinking it should probably land like right around here. We could probably put some gatehouses here too. Uh, this is clearly within range of our genders that are existing uh, because we've repaired these roads. So let's see if we can uh, put down some uh, some walls. I think we're going to uh, use stone walls. We have quite a lot of stone still. See, we did... Uh, Seven wide. Do have fifteen workers uh, to help out with this. Uh, I'm not even sure if this is like a good layout. We might need to change all of this. Uh, looks like they're just standard walls. So, so fortifications, so stairs we can use to get on top of them. Now maybe we want to make these walls even more thick, perhaps? Maybe we should test with our military, have them see about, about mustering and moving up here. Do we just, like, line this with stairs? Uh, we also need to fell some trees, though, so let's do that. And we should probably fell some trees that allow us to uh, to shoot people a little bit easier here. Let's cut these trees. accepting up to 325 so this uh, person should come in then again I realized my mistake earlier I mentioned that uh, the authorized doesn't work all the time I think it's actually just taking into consideration the uh, it might it, it, I think it's only taking into consideration like the pleb count so it's probably removing like nobilities from it which might also be why it's not authorizing right now because we have two of those should take in one though I would think I think it's about time we have a fourth deliveryman. Uh, okay, hold on. We lost a lot of people. Ah. Let's just do five of you for now. Need to make sure we keep enough odd jobbers to keep things going around here. Uh, and then, yeah, let's authorize those three. I think we still have plenty of fruit, it's just not, yeah, it hasn't been hauled, that's the problem. Extra delivery men should help. Might even move up to five. I'm starting to get into a bigger city here. 
Okay. So yeah, it may be better. Uh, I guess these fortifications are just elevated, in, in a sense, like elevated uh, platforms. So let's uh, build them out a little bit more. here we should be able to line up along the, the edge here or line up right here so let's see what this kind of looks like um what <laughs> what was that Interesting, huh? Hmm. Maybe they need. To, maybe they do need to be bigger. Jobbers are busy uh, working on something. I'm not sure what yet. Uh, the wet nurses are at max uh, workloads. So we'll add another one of them. Okay. We should probably add another division too. I'm debating whether I want a... Another uh, archer division or another melee one. I'm thinking. Thinking archery. Although, I guess we could just increase their uh, training potential here. Just make them uh, even better at their job. We do have 72 bows, though. We might be able to get to the point where we can support uh, a second division here. We can always make it just 20 strong, too, though. Hmm. Uh, let's actually hold off for now. Uh, everyone's pretty much working as hard as they can right now. Upgrade that training room as well. see how that goes. Speed the game a bit more. Uh, yeah, it seems like they kind of stopped, huh? They must have been busy doing something else. Oh yeah, that's right, chopping the trees. Yeah, it's a noble pursuit. Could probably actually chop down more. So the issue with the throne room here is they're going to make a beeline for it through this forest line. We'd rather have them come here. So I don't know if just making a, uh, a bigger wall would be the ideal option. Just have it like, just cover this area right here. Or we can just have it, uh, yeah, shoot up through here. These guys tend to come, like, right down here. Um, so they tend to follow the roadway. Maybe this is too curved, too. Maybe we should have had it, like, straighter. More gradually decline, because I want it to kind of land right here. Use this natural uh, rock to uh, help defend. Reduce the area at which they can approach us.
So let's kind of plan this out a little bit more here. Let's just do the initial wall. Uh, so the innermost wall should be like right here, I think. Yeah, right here. So let's do maybe like about 12. No, maybe even like Sixteen. Okay. Might not be a good enough range. Uh, well... Yeah, it's just a bit too much. So let's uh, delete all these. We'll do fifteen, or let's do uh, fourteen. This is obviously just the initial, uh, the initial barricade, basically, if you will. Just need to control these fights a little bit better. Is this still not good enough? Mm, yeah, it's still not good enough. Okay, so I guess maybe the 12 that we had originally was right. Try it. Uh, try it one more time. That's <laughs> still not good enough. Uh, all right, let's drop it down to ten. You'd think it would move up a lot faster than that. The reason why I'm doing this, by the way, as opposed to just a flat wall, uh, is because uh, the roundness mechanic uh, in the game, which is no longer a thing we've had to talk about at all, um, has been completely reworked. Uh, in the past, you used to have to build your buildings in a rounded manner, uh, meaning like, you know, having like extra pillars and whatnot. Um, an easy way to, to do this was to add like a, like shrink your room on the corners here. Would give you a lot of points towards the uh, roundedness. And the Tlopi like the more organic slash rounded, uh, you know, structure. Uh, they completely removed that from the actual rooms themselves, so they don't care about that anymore. Uh, but they instead made it so that they want their walls to be rounded, uh, and that and that matters for their um, uh, for their uh, you know for their uh, their happiness basically. So let's see. Uh, this should work out pretty well. So we might just knock this thing down. Well, let's see. Let's delete. Delete all that for now. Yeah, this will be perfect. So we might just uh, might just remove all of this. Let's just remove the stairs, actually. Yeah, unfortunately, we'll just remove all that, and then we'll redraw right here. Have a little gap here. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yep. We could actually just make this one wider anyway, uh, so that it's only the road. Yeah, let's do that. Alright, that should give them uh, something to work on for 
at least a year or two. Of course, uh, next time Code and Rake attacks, they'll probably attack from over here. <laughs> okay, here we go. We'll find out uh, shortly here. pretty quick siege. They usually give us a little bit more time. It's probably because they killed some of us. Um, t -t 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 -t. Yeah, we don't have any recruits. Uh, everyone needs to train. Three people are actually fully trained. So we may try to meet them on the field again and just uh, avoid the situation of uh, them like collapsing on us. So as soon as they start to get melee uh, units closer, we'll just back off entirely. Uh, we still have quite enough armor and weapons and shields. We don't have any of them. Uh, to, to actually try to put up a, uh, a fight here. Rather just keep our people training. Could go for the uh, Taylor uh, upgrade, which would help uh, reduce uh, some of our workload here. Um, how many scientists do we have? 62. Max cap of knowledge is 4.95k, and we have allocated 4.7k, so we're actually not getting any more science. Um, if we want to get more science, we need to add more scientists, obviously. And uh, another route we could take is trying to go for the improved laboratory, which requires uh, 1,200. But that allows us to upgrade and make more science. Um, might be a route that we want to take. For now, let's add a couple more scientists. We'll think about it. Then I think we can build, um, yeah, gatehouses. Subjects press really well, holding off enemies. They're a bit weaker than walls, but allows us to. Oh, check that out! They're coming over here. Unfortunately for them, uh, this thing's going to be long broken by the time I get here. Oh, they're just straight running in. Oh, man. <laughs> Did they kill one of our nobles? Oh, man. So they're just, they're just uh, blitzkrieging us now. Um, let's make our way over here. effectively using the um now how trained are these guys these are Carthemis with plate armor shields and uh <laughs> and uh falcatas <sighs> and these guys are still just taking forever can you yeah use a better route Doesn't look like we're going to be able to do anything about them. Seems like they like to rush basically right into our city. So we may want to remove like a lot of the forests uh, in our city. Proper at least. Trajectory blocked by terrain. Wait, did they scatter? Wait, what? What is going on here? Did they actually scatter? Look at that, they scattered. Now, does this mean... They're no longer enemies? Like playing dead, are they? <laughs> oh 
<laughs> okay. They are really respecting our archery soldiers here. Uh, let's see, what unit is this? This is a division of Tilapis uh, with plate armor and warhammers. Yeah, see, so the issue is we just have too many trees around here. Of course, if we have this wall uh, fully built, then they won't be able to just run in like that. Uh, looks like we scattered these guys anyway. Um, hmm. Yeah, so the problem is they're just going to get in close. And uh, we can't fire on them. Hmm. Man, yeah, there's really no way to deal with that then for us right now. So, um, gosh, I'd hate to have, uh, I'd hate to retreat, but we pretty much have to. Right, we have no play here. See how they react to this. Okay, they just run forward. So let's uh, break apart. <laughs> yeah, we have no answer for that. Our whole basic, <laughs> our whole, uh, the whole premise behind our military is to fire at them, um, since they're mostly melee, and we excel at you know archery and whatnot. Probably uh, do less clicking here now. Hopefully. Just make it so they get nothing. Man. People are getting caught. Yeah, so we definitely need walls to control the uh, control the area at which they can fight us. I think that's more important than like trying to chop down a bunch of trees. We could chop down like this area of trees so that we have a clear firing uh, view in the future. Just do one of each and then see where it goes. Uh, we'll add one for uh, shields too. Probably start making those here as well. So we did lose one person in the army. They must have got caught when they were uh, retreating. Uh, unfortunately it was a archer, so... Okay. Everyone should be returning to uh, practice. Yep, looks good. Still have four odd jobbers to deal with the... Uh, yeah. Pretty intense uh, rebuilding or uh, building efforts here. These code and rank guys are going to take it, man. One of these days... We are gradually getting stronger. Make no mistake. 
uh, we will employ these buildings. So I wonder if uh, I wonder if those 15 people that scattered, I'm guessing they probably get to keep them, obviously, right? It's an interesting me interesting mechanic, though, because they kind of ran forward and we just kind of walked up to them, and they didn't want to fight us. And so it makes me wonder if they thought they would probably all die in that situation. So they just avoided the inevitable. I don't think we were strong enough to kill them, though, is the thing. First crime has been committed. Uh, we'll have to look into this in the future. Uh, it was a theft. So people don't like that. Uh, we actually, uh, Tilapia have a tendency not to do theft, I believe. Yeah. We we're pretty anti-theft. Uh, as, com as compared to the, uh, the humans and the, uh, the lizard people, apparently. And the lizards like their crime. I'm surprised the Dondorians are the same as the elves, but whatever. Okay. Add another uh, thing for cotton. Uh, now, we could always expand the existing archery uh, unit. However, I kind of like the option of having the ability to split them. It's like have two separate, ven um, <clears throat> two separate uh, spots where we can set up and, and blast from. Uh, gives them less of an opportunity to pin down that archer unit, um, since there'll be another one, like, guarding them effectively. So I think I do want another archer unit. Uh, we'll get that created now. And, uh, let's make it, um, like that or something. Yeah, we have to accept it, right? There we go. Covering fire. Give them just a little bit of uh, training right now. Uh, we'll make it only 20 people strong, too. We don't want it to overwhelm the, uh, the work of our main squad. We just want to fill it in here, as time permits. Down to two odd jobbers uh, because we lost three people. Do have a ton of fabric now. Uh, we could sell our fabric since we don't really have a need for it. It's above 50%. We'll sell uh, sell off any excess. Uh, maybe the same thing for uh, shelves. Might be time to sell some of those. Oh no, that's right. We're not going to do that. I'm going to add that, and then we're going to switch the switch the carpenter over to shields. Oh my gosh, that uses up way too much. Hold on. Well, I guess we have a lot right now. Maybe we could let that run for a bit. Um, now let's do this. Uh, this way we get some odd jobbers to uh, help out with this. We do get thirty, about 35 a day from each of these. So that's pretty good. Yeah, we need to fell more trees too. Good, good call to do this. Um, 
Let's chop down this area too, because uh, we'll probably look to build. We might look to build the initial wall, like right, right, right through here, huh? Maybe. Just a huge tree cut. Uh, let's actually ramp up the delivery men too to get things uh, hauled. Since we have the spare workforce to get it done right now. Already got seven recruits in the new... Uh, We don't even have enough recruits for this yet. That's fine, though. These guys are the more specialized people anyway. Could get rid of our opiates, too. Let's do that. Can sell <laughs> fabric for seven? You're joking. Man, these guys must have a massive... Uh, fabric, uh, um, fabric, uh, fabric industry, weaving industry, man. They don't buy cotton at all, period. And then fabric's only seven. Hmm. We could probably, you know what we could do? We could make our tailor use the fabric, but that requires tech. That might be a good way to go about it, though. Because that would also free up some uh, some leather for more uh, armaments. But that would also mean that we can't do the improved lab. I think we go for the improved lab first, and then we'll try to go for that fine clothing. So let's... Uh, oops, I did not mean to click you. To 68 scientists for now. Uh, and then it shows, by the way, the target too, so we can get an idea of how much we're going to gain from that. We'll probably need about another, I don't know, 12 scientists maybe to reach the goal that we need. But once we do, we'll get a huge, uh, just natural buff uh, for even more science. So it'll be worthwhile. We will need metal for that, but uh, our metal guys are working pretty well. Could add, could make this uh, refined as well if we had the tech too. Might be something to look at. So this will make uh, going up here a little bit less convenient for our people, but uh, I think it's worth it. Okay, we're ready to build. Uh, and then let's... Uh, t -t -t -t. Well, how, how big do we want to make these walls, you know? Let's cancel that job. Hold on. Okay. And then... Gay houses use metal, too. That's kind of crazy. Wait, what is this? Are these, like... Is it supposed to look like that? Or is it like I should be wide? Hold on. Might be wide. Let's see what that looks like. 
All right. Uh, we kind of have everything we need, to be honest. Um, we really just need to win these fights. So I think we're heading in the right direction for that. Uh, we're going to have shields next time. Uh, hopefully a good amount. Looks like we're making quite a few. Uh, we're going to run out of uh, leather soon, though. To that end, we may... Uh, we may uh, slap down another uh, pasture here soon. Might move it up here. It's going to take a long time to clear out all these trees. Alright. Super speed. Yeah, we really don't need to buy anything either. Um, we're pretty stable. Um, we could actually try to buy clothes, actually, maybe? Just to make, uh, make them happier, I guess. Could also try to buy weapons, but these things, or uh, armor, maybe? Falcatas are 400 a pop. Kind of want flanks, I think. Could also just straight up buy plate armor. Kind of like the idea of weapons, though. So. I uh, could also buy tools. Tools might be a good route to take, but those are also kind of expensive. Clothes are 46. Hmm. Interesting dilemma. So let's, uh... T -t 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 -t. Oh yeah, we won't, be able to, we won't be able to buy these anyway, because minimum uh, trades are in 32s, I think it said last time. So we would need... Four th yeah, we'd need 12,000 bucks. Not gonna happen. Hmm. Could just straight up buy clothes and be done with it. That's really the only thing I can think of. Let's get rid of our herbs now. Let's uh, do one less crate for meat. That should allow him to start exporting, maybe? No. Two crates of meat. Or no, wait. <laughs> we want this. Okay, hold on. Back to four crates of meat. We want to increase the export. Above uh, t -t 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 fifty percent, maybe. That yeah, looks like a good number. So we are starting to export some. Uh, let's do forty percent. Do buy it for four, which isn't completely terrible. It's a pretty good price. I guess we'll just import clothes, I suppose. It's better than nothing. We'll just do small imports on this. Yeah, we've got a lot of uh, we've got a lot of stuff, to be honest. Um, need this much cut stone or anything either. So we could start knocking down maybe some of our industries here. Uh, and just make room for more soldiers. Did that... Okay, so that doesn't save either. Yeah, I kind of I kinda would like it if um, there was no accept or cancel here at all. To be honest. Just me, though, maybe. Um, who do we want to give? We want to give the shields to... 
Well, this is adds defense skill and hit points too, so it might be good to have these on both. For now, let's do just you guys. Uh, I guess we do have a Falcata still. They gave us one uh, a while ago. The jerks. Yeah. <laughs> one. Um, we could, you know, we could spend uh, this extra money on just ramping up our metal industry. I like the idea of that. So let's add a few more of these guys. Uh, we'll also add four more scientists for now. Just keep enough odd jobbers around. Uh, they still got a lot of stuff to chop down. You know, we also could just give away the fabric. Let's do that for now. And let's uh, cancel this export, since they don't buy it for anything anyway. They'll like that. Oh, we are actually building up leather still. Wow. Uh, Alright, well, let's make more shields then. I'd like a good, like, couple hundred of these. 150, maybe. Uh, we'll probably end up giving them to our archer squad, too. So maybe they won't uh, lose people when they get um, a return volley. Looks like the clothes import is working. Add another tailor or two. People should be pretty happy with this. Uh, let's see, services is lacking. Uh, lavatories. They don't have enough access to lavatories. Uh, do we still just have the one lavatory? Is that, is that why? Yeah, that might explain it. Uh, so let's go ahead and add another lavatory over yonder. Let's flip it like this. Like that. that looks good to me. These things are cheap. Okay, uh, okay, this is done. And then, yeah, okay, yeah, it is, uh, it is just a, uh, wall that they can walk through. Perfect. Alright, uh, so let's see. Let's continue the building of this. Uh, this is ten wide. Man, can we just turn off this guy? Just stop talking? <laughs> ten. Yeah, that shouldn't cause any problems for now. And we can always move these walls later on. I think these are good spots for it for now, though. Okay, let's uh, zoom out a bit. It's a bit difficult to see right now. Bad weather for it. Let's actually speed up the game a bit. Just to discourage them from uh, trying to like go around it, I think this should be fine. Uh, we'll use this as a test. So if they if they come from the north, if they swoop around here, then we'll know that we just need to wall it off completely. Come on in. Uh, they don't even have the uh, lavatory yet. Speed up the game. What are they doing right now, anyway? Are they building this stuff? No? Uh, oh, you know what? We might need this janitor, too. What's this janitor's range? Uh, 
Uh, yes, we will, uh, yeah, we'll actually need, uh, we might need a generator, like, right up here, actually. Um. Because this won't, uh, this won't go out long enough, I don't think. So let's, uh, stick one right there. Right there is fine. And the person that works this won't have a house, um, most likely. Unfortunately, they have a tough job. Is this thing being maintained this whole time? Let's just, uh, remove this entirely. Uh, fisher- uh, fisheries are... just terrible. <laughs> there we go. Just pretend that part of our history never existed. Uh, fish are a waste of time, for sure. Uh, I guess maybe if you have, uh, upgrades it could- could work out, or if you have a species that's good at fishing. Maybe it'll work better, but for us, not even something we consider anymore. Oh, we have a ton of wood now. Oh, we're using a lot of wood, so I'm not too worried about it. Seems like the aid delivery men are staying busy constantly. Yeah. Uh, no auto employee, just one one plumber. Sometimes they get the uh, wise idea that they need more than one plumber, uh, which they never do. They can't. <laughs> they can't need more than one plumber with this amount of work. They're just lazy, all right? And so uh, we assume that they will actually come for the gatehouse, right? Because it's weaker. And so... Um, so let's build additional walls up here, and then add some stairs so that we can get on top of it. We might have to adjust this road a little bit um, for the stairs. Well, maybe we won't. Well, I don't even know how many stairs we need. Like, can we get away with just this? Probably like draining our uh, stone here. Yeah, we're kind of out of stone. Uh, it's fine. I think we have. Oh, we don't have an import for it. Uh, I don't think we need it right now. Anyway, let's clear some rock instead. They have so much work to do, but they have 19 of them, so they're able to get it done in pretty short order. Twenty-seven shields already, too. Hundred bows. Excellent. This is going well. Uh, okay, we don't have any people training. <clears throat> so, uh, let's increase... Um, yeah, I think we increase the melee soldiers' melee training. That... Did it, did it just completely... Ignore that? Uh, Alright, so uh, we'll get them trained even further. Now we're down to five. Gotcha. I was wondering, you know, I, I need to keep an eye on that. Like when we suddenly get a bunch of workers, it's probably because they're not doing this. Yep, all of these uh, ranges are working. It says to max, it's just night time, so they're done for the day. 67 men. So I guess they do get to keep them. They just, they basically just abandon the, uh, abandon the divisions. So they don't get chopped down. All right. Well, hopefully uh, we can test this new wall, although it's not uh, built yet. This is 
suspend jobs and activate those. They did come from the north again. Interesting. It's like they're taunting us, to be honest. Uh, let's uh, delete these jobs for now. We don't need any more wood. Now, I wonder if we can rearrange divisions. I hope we can. Uh, you guys aren't really fit for combat at all, so we'll just have you stick stick uh, back there. So hopefully we can get over here, is the goal. Now are they... What do they do here? Yeah, they do just stop, huh? Which gives us enough time to muster up and head over there. Okay, what is this? They uh, made their way into the uh, tree line again, unfortunately. So how did they get through? Did they break this, uh, this gatehouse down already? So we're going to need another gatehouse. Or did they just run through here? I missed it. Ah, this stupid terrain, man. I really like to blast these guys. Okay. Let's move the uh, military in over here. To attack. Now this will actually, it looks like, give us enough time. Uh, the wall's not done yet, unfortunately, but... Wait, what? I thought I moved... Are you guys not moving? Come on, man. <laughs> I told them to attack, so I assumed that they would just start marching towards them, but... Really, they don't do that. Okay, they scattered. Okay, so archers move. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, they're just straight running at us now. Okay, I don't know if we want any of this. Man! Okay, so yeah, they slipped through right here. Mm -hmm. I think we can get them if we, uh,. If we actually have a wall that they have to bust down first. The problem is they're just running into position. I guess we could run into position too. So that might be something to try next time. Dang it. Freaking Codenreich, man. I should thank them though. They're helping us out. Figuring out how to do the, uh, the old combat stuff. Darn Codenreich. Yeah, th this whole forested area won't matter soon, uh, because uh, we will meet them out here instead. Ah, man. Well, we'll meet them, like, in this general area, maybe, or something. Either way, it probably will be a little bit easier to deal with. There's a lot of forest over here, too, but... Hmm. Okay, we have to, uh them from looting us. Uh, they can take our four bread. Keep the change. Did 
Definitely not having any of our uh, tools of war, for sure. Hopefully they enjoy. I'm pretty sure two of those, one of these. Yeah, a lot easier now that we have uh, the upgraded warehouse for sure. Uh, let's see. Uh, whoops. And um, I just thought about it. We could just keep ramping up our uh, our metal smithing here. Uh, and then eventually we can make smithies. So we can make our own armor. It's a very high value skill. Especially for us right now. We really don't need things like uh, cut stone. So we might even like eliminate basically our masons. have them do other uh, stuff that helps us out. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we'll let the warehouse fill up a bit, and then as soon as it looks normalized, uh, I'll knock down a couple of the delivery men again. They could definitely use the uh, the work, but uh, kind of need uh, we kind of need uh, stuff to get built here because we still have to build the wall over here too. Six odd jobbers, it's not bad. Uh, warehouse looks pretty stable now. Uh, we'll just knock out one actually for now. Eight, eight odd jobbers is okay, I'm fine with that number. So I guess we'll activate these jobs again. They did actually build the stairs. We'll let them finish this. Uh, let's plan this out while they do that. So I think I want... kind of want the... Um, I kind of prefer them to be met, like, right out here. So let's build the... Hmm. Yeah, let's do this. So from this wall, we'll come out. Let's do tens again. See how this uh, works. Um, shift click for that. Let's just start over with that. Ten. I think you can do a planning mode, right? Yeah, planning. So let's uh, t -t 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 let's uh, suspend these for now. If you do it in the planning mode, I think it won't actually activate the jobs. I think, yeah, perfect. That's exactly what we want. We can let the game go, and uh, we can just plan. Is this gonna get us where we need to be? Uh, doesn't look like it. Uh, it'll get us probably close though. Uh, we'll keep we'll keep at it. Dirty orcs. <laughs> uh, 
Well, yeah, it is pretty close. I think we could... I think we're fine with this, though, too. Because we're going to keep coming out like this. Yeah, actually, I like this, too. Seems... This seems fine. You can just cop, chop down these trees, and it's mostly an open area. Um... And when they approach from the west, we'll have to see what it looks like. Okay, uh, so I think that's the peak right there, so we'll start to double back a bit. bit further out than I would have wanted. So maybe it would have been better to go right here. So I would have preferred to have it like this. Uh, let's see. Well, this is pretty much flat with... Wait, so we could have had the middle right here. So if we did that... Yeah. That would have probably been better. Now, I think what we can do then in that case is just use the room copier tool, or uh, copy area. Uh, well, t nah, not mountain. We don't need the mountain. Perfect. So, uh, let's delete these jobs. And, uh, we'll also delete these jobs, too. Uh, let's see. We'll make this the middle right here, I think. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah, this looks great. These code and ranks aren't going to know what hit them. Um, okay, yeah, they're still busy. Uh, let's see. Cancel that. Ten. This whole field. We're gonna need a uh, janitor, probably a couple janitors out here too, unfortunately. Hey, that lines up pretty well, huh? this one doing, by the way? Oh, it's not done yet. Just put it like... Just put it like right here for now. Uh, hopefully that will cover... Uh, I don't know if it's gonna cover. We might need... We might even need a second one. Anyway. Let's deactivate the planning mode, and then, uh, clear some rock, because we're going to need it. Just clear some rock around the city for now. Uh, oh, wow, we have a lot still here. Uh, well, that's a lot of work. Uh, that's fine, though.
Are the two bakers able to keep up with the grain? I think they are. Because we do only have two, right? Yeah. They use up 12 a day. It should be fine. They should knock all that out by the time next year comes. Okay, so what's the range on this thing? Perfect, perfect, perfect. Might have to move it a little bit to the east. Uh, should we need to. Yeah. Uh, and in the meantime, they will fix up this. Uh, we only need to employ one max. Start to let a bit more people in. Uh, the next round, we'll definitely need to uh, increase our food supply. Uh, an option for that would be to just import grain. But I want to be careful about uh, import-export policies here because we can't always rely on them because of code and rank number one. And then number two, we're not really selling a whole lot of uh, advanced goods. Could buy enough Falcata to do this gladiator too, but that's gonna take a long time. It'd be nice if we could buy machinery too, but these things are probably prohibitively expensive too. Up to 130 soldiers now. Everyone's working, so. We have 10 odd jobbers, too. It's pretty pretty nice. Let's move this up, I suppose. And then... 108 bows. Got a lot of leather armor, actually. Could drop this down, uh, but we're actually still making a lot of leather. Wow, that's crazy. Um, this looks pretty good. So let's uh, get these guys have uh, bows and armor. Um, we might give them. Shield two. Let's do that. Yeah. So make sure we're pumping out more shields. Um, yeah, we could probably afford to have another person working this. Those thunders, by the way, are the uh. Oh, the, the omens to Codenreich. Letting them know maybe they shouldn't come in here. Uh, somehow this guy has a job still. Uh, what are they doing? Oh yeah, they're still... That's fine. I'll finish that. takes a long time. We actually have a dumb amount of stone, too. Uh, let's, uh... Let's, uh... Delete these jobs for now. L uh, some of them. Most of them. Want them to go back to doing this. We really need to finish this. And, uh, once this is done, we will, uh... We'll start to build this wall, too. This is gonna be great. Uh, obviously, it's not going to extend all the way down here, uh, at least uh, for now. But we could um, 
could look to maybe like curve it through here like have a second gatehouse like right here and then just curve it uh, this way no one comes from the south this is where Ixpin comes from I think so well we can look at the map right yeah Ixpin should come from uh, well, I guess they can come to us from no yeah they do come to us from the water so that's uh, this way They've only got 150 people. Probably recruiting their last little bit of people before they come and mar uh, march in again. Uh, perfect. They're building this. Oh, we do have 24 odd jobbers. Okay. Let's activate these jobs. go three wide on the fortifications. I don't know how uh, important that is, but it sounds cool. And that's what we do here in Akrift. We're cool. Alright. I think uh, that's probably a good time to call it, right? for a bit. We've got plenty of food to uh, support all these people. Uh, 130 soldiers. Uh, we're getting equipped with armor, shields, um, and we're going to start making weapons again soon. Warhammers should suffice, I think. We really just basically need to, for the warrior group, we just really need to hold the line, you know? And so we just want them to be as trained as possible. 32 workers. What's going on here? Uh, uh, that's that's fine for now, but we're gonna have to find them a job. We might add, we might add another orchard next time too. Although we have plenty of fruit. Well, we'll figure out what we're gonna do next time. So again, hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you then. Peace. <laughs>